A group of people wearing masks entered a cafe in Montgomery County and stole an Israeli flag hanging inside. The owner of the restaurant is shaken up, and our Greg Payne has more for us. He's live in Huntington Valley. Greg? Yes, yeah, Sheba, there's quite a bit of anger and frustration after this incident. Now, you can see here at the restaurant, there is an Israeli flag that is hanging up. But where that anger stems from is the fact that the original flag was stolen in the first place. For the Huntington Valley community, Cafe Olay in the Valley is a home away from home. This is a peaceful uh, environment. People come here to work. People come here to relax. People come here you know, to meet their siblings, moms, dads. But unfortunately, last night, Lawrence Kalikman, one of the owners of the cafe, says that wasn't the case. Probably the best way to describe it is surreal. Just after 5 p.m., surveillance video shows a group of people with masks enter into the cafe and immediately head for the Israeli flag on the back of the restaurant. They then rip it off the wall and quickly run out, leaving customers and his staff scared. It was hate. It was terrifying, in fact. And I'm sorry that they, they had to go through that. I'm sorry anybody would have to go through that. It's pointless, it's meaningless, and it defeats what this coffee shop stands for. Which what the coffee truly stands for can be seen within the customers, like Adam Solaw, a local resident who's been coming to the cafe since it opened. You see it on TV, you see it happen in other places, but you don't expect it at your local shop where you hang out. So definitely surprised, felt some anger. And then I just wanted to figure out how to support them. Which that's exactly what he did. All right, it's going to be 302. All right. All right, you're all good. Um, but he's covered by Adam, um, one of our um, regular customers. He's covering everybody's top today. A nice gesture to show his sign of support for the business that he calls home. My thinking is if you're going to come and, you know, uh, support any one of the places in your community, this is one of the ones in Huntington Valley that you're going to want to support. As for Kalikman, he wants the people who did this held accountable. I hope that they're caught and they're prosecuted to the full extent so that people like them or people in the community, people who want to cause hate, violence, or disruption in a peaceful environment, understand that it's not going to be tolerated. Now, the flag is not the only sign of support here at the restaurant. They actually do have some of these items here up for sale in support of Israel. Now, the owner says the reason why they have all this is not just because of the attacks, but also because they have an employee who is Israeli. Now, police say if you have any information regarding this, to contact them. Jason and Chiba. Greg Payne, thank you very much.